that meeting the following. So I don't know um, what time that meeting was supposed to be. I don't know what location that was supposed to be at. Are these maps making sense in terms of where these possible sightings are? Is that leading towards her father's house? Um, I don't know, but um, this is the only place where I'm seeing that reference. And I'm just unclear about what it means. Once again, October 30th, 2019, a candlelit vigil held for a birthday of Georgina Garcala. Um, family is just keeping on top of it, absolutely doing it right, doing the events and then getting the press to recognize those events and getting her story out there time and time again. At expressandstar.com, family carry out own reconstruction, and this is from December 2019. Her family have carried out a reconstruction as they believe detectives have not carried out a proper CCTV search, having only uncovered an eight second clip from the time of her disappearance. I've been honest with you guys, I've been struggling with that aspect with this story the whole time. Um, I just don't know how they didn't piece together some other steps of where she went once she hit that, the, the door at that store. There has to have been another camera that picked her up somewhere, and how come we don't have that information? How come it's not made public so that that can jog the memories of people in that area? Um, I don't know. Andrea Garcala, the missing woman's mother, said, sadly, we as a family feel that Whenever there was a choice for Sussex police to do more or less, they did less. We have had to take the lead in the investigation and have been forced to because the police have been so reluctant to do the basics, never mind go the extra mile. We've been forced to release our own reconstruction of Georgina's last movements. Sussex police wouldn't do it. The family have recruited Clive Driscoll, the former detective chief inspector for technical guidance. Mr. Driscoll said, I am very surprised that Sussex did not facilitate a reconstruction 20 months ago, and I'm convinced that this reconstruction can make a positive difference in the search for Georgina. The Sussex 